Welcome to this walk around of my Powell's 46 International Fast Cruiser. She was built in 1978 and it's a custom build. All of the 14 that were built were custom made for the Mediterranean. I've had her for 15 years now and we replaced the engines about 10 years ago uh, and completely rebuilt the engines at the same time. They've got about 400 hours on them now, just over. Uh, six years ago, she was gel peeled and copper coated with full osmosis treatment. So uh, all of that's been done. She's also had new props and earth bonding. And as I say, this summer the project was to replace the rear deck uh, which had been leaking so that is now complete and the walk around here is from august just before she went back in the water moving on to the interior uh, this is a view of the front v-berth uh, the V-Birth itself has got uh, an ensuite, which we'll see shortly. To the left of the rebirth, you've got the galley area with seating. And uh, to the right of the V-Birth here, you've got the day head, which is uh, toilet, shower, sink, etc. Here's a view of the ensuite for the V-Birth. Again, toilet, shower, head, uh, electric toilets throughout. To the left here, there is a bunk cabin, which uh, isn't shown on the video. The cable you see there is to frostats, which are in the engine room, uh, so that uh, she's not going to take any harm over the winter. Here's the con area, which has got uh, two chart plotters, uh, autopilot, etc. A nice area here for the saloon which leads us onto the rear cabin. This cabin is currently unfinished as you can see but um, there isn't a lot needed to finish this off and uh, hopefully you get an idea as to what the plans were. The main unfinished area is the rear bathroom which again is an ensuite so the plumbing is in and the lights obviously they work but then the ceiling needs to be put in the Wabasto has been reconnected and there is a inlet uh, there and a new seacock here for the toilet outlet um, and um, yeah I've just run out of time to be able to do this particular project uh, which is why we're looking to sell the boat and why she's priced as she is. But the deck has been replaced, so all of this is now watertight. And uh, I think it will make a great uh, boat f for someone for a liverboard. It has a uh, dishwasher. It has uh, lots of space. You've got uh, heating throughout the boat with the hot air Wabasto system. You've got the flybridge, which gives you, uh, again, another chart plotter and uh, the controls duplicated uh, outside. Uh, so you can drive the boat from the flybridge or from the con uh, in front of the saloon.